This is just going to be a quick video about statically charged meter movements on various pieces of test equipment. It might apply to your multimeter. Different movements have different susceptibility than others. Not every movement is going to be the same. Now if it's the winter time where you are or if you live in a dry arid climate it'll be pretty easy for static electricity to build up on a plastic faced meter movement. Let me demonstrate that. So you want to give it a clean Sometimes you can even run your hand over the movement and it will statically charge it. Now here I have a cloth that is just damp, very little water on there. I'm going to place it, try to see if I can show this effect on the movement and it will dissipate the charge. And you don't want to try to dry it back off. That's why I say very lightly damp because your charge will come right back. Usually how I do it is I'll take the damp rag, I'll just lightly drag it across the meter movement, and the charge will be dissipated. I'm not sure if my hands will be dry enough, but now sometimes you can generate one with your fingers. But if you do happen to find some static buildup on any of your meter movements, you have to do is take a damp cloth, t-shirt, anything like that. Just wipe it across and the static charge will be dissipated. You could use a paper towel, but you will run the risk of putting micro scratches on the meter face. So that's going to be up to you what kind of wiping device you use, but just a little bit of water. You just need it damp. It doesn't need to be soaking wet. And you'll be able to dissipate static charge on any of your meters. There are many different causes for a meter that does not return to zero properly. Your meter could be damaged. You may have to adjust the mechanical zero. You could have a static charge. There might be partic particulate matter within the coil of the meter. This video only applies to static charge. If you try this and you try other methods and your meter will still not return to zero reliably, then your meter movement is probably damaged and you'll have to, you know, do something else about it. Probably replace it.